Hey guys, I pray that all is well. I pray that y'all test the spirit by the spirit to know if this word is for you. So today, God has given me divine clarity on forgiveness. Forgiveness, but not just for others, but for ourselves. Um, a lot of us are very hard on ourselves more than others are. We're very forgiven. Um, as it states in Ephesians 4.32, Ephesians 4.32, it says, Instead, be kind to each other, tenderhearted, forgiving one another, just as God through Christ has forgiven you. So we're on the end of forgiving others and not forgiving ourselves. See, Christ, God gave us Christ and he died on that cross for our sins. And he forgave us of our sins. But sometimes we sit ourselves in self-condemnation. And God didn't give us that spirit. He said we all fall short of the glory of God. He did not give us the spirit of condemning anyone, let alone ourselves. God said, I did not give you that spirit. Earlier as I was waking up, he told me I did not give you the spirit of fear, but power, love, and a sound mind. Fear and shame and guilt can be a thing that God has to work on in healing you. You don't have to sit there and soak in the pain of the things that you have overcome or the things that you have went through to overcome. Because Jesus didn't die on that cross for us to, to stay there and dwell in that sin. Whatever you have overcame, whatever he has taken you out of, whatever he has delivered you from, whatever he has delivered you from because we can't do it on our own it's not by not by might not by power but by his spirit whatever he has delivered you from do not sit and bask in the fact that you had done the things that you did it's already over what is already done it is finished now you are a new creature you are a new creation guys i pray that y'all have a blessed evening i pray that y'all continue to let god work inside of you and use you don't be afraid don't be afraid bye guys